I'm going to show you how to get a voice changer on PS5 for free. Let's do this. The best method for this does require a PC or laptop of some sorts, but I will show a method at the end of the video for mobile users too. So if you want to be able to play games seamlessly whilst using a voice changer, you need to go onto your PS5 and create a new user. This user does need to have a PSN account, but PS Plus is not required. If you are just doing this as a one-time thing and don't mind about a small bit of lag when playing for a bit, you can skip this step. Once you have made the new user, go to settings, then users and accounts, then other and make sure the PS5 is activated as that account's main system. After that, go to system settings, then remote play and make sure remote play is enabled. Now head on over to your computer. First off, you want to download any sort of real-time voice changer. I recommend voice mod which is linked in the description. Go through the setup process until the application is installed and then open up the app. You should now be prompted to select your microphone and speakers, so for this setup you need to take your headset you like to use and connect that to your PC. A lot of headsets will connect just fine with an aux cord, but I advise you to check the instructions manual for your specific headset to check how to connect it to the PC in case you do need any sort of adapter. If you have a mic on your PC, then you can skip this step anyway. With the headset or mic connected, choose that microphone and then choose the output to be the headset you connected or your PC speakers. Voice mod is now set up and you can test voice changes by selecting them, enabling the hear myself feature at the bottom left and speaking. Custom voices as well as the complete soundboard can also be found within the voice mod software. Once you are sure voice mod is working perfectly, disable the hear myself function, then open up your main settings, then system, then sound and set the default microphone input to be the voice mod output, as well as the default sound output to be your headset or speakers. This is an extremely important step and this will not work without doing this. After that, go to the second download link in the description to install PS remote play onto your device. Open the app up, then sign into the second account we created at the start of the video. The reason for this account is so that you can continue to play on your main display as usual, but without the lag. If you did not make the second account, then signing into your main account here means that you have to play via remote play, which can be quite laggy and not ideal. Once signed in, go to settings, then video quality for remote play, and take it down to something on the lower end so that your voice is as smooth as possible when going through remote play. Now choose to connect to a PS5 and wait until it successfully connects. When connected, you can use your mouse and keyboard to navigate to the party to join on remote play. To enable the voice changer, unmute the remote play mic which can be done by clicking the microphone icon at the bottom right of the remote play window. You then want to go back over to your main display that your PS5 is connected to, pick up your controller, turn it on and sign into your main account which should also be in the party. To stop any form of echo, on your main account, mute the second account and then mute the controller mic. If you are doing this with just the one account, then there is no second account of yours in the party, so you don't need to bother muting anyone. All of this should work with Game Chat too. For those of you without a computer, you can sort of use a phone. To do this, you want to install any real-time voice changer from the App Store or Google Play Store and connect your headset to your phone. You then want to connect earbuds to your PS5, making sure the microphone on the earbuds is placed inside the headset cup, so just in that little bit of space between the headset and your ear. When speaking with a real-time voice changing app on the mobile phone, your changed voice is then outputted through your headset and then inputted into the PS5 via the microphone on the earbuds. If this video helped you out, then please hit that like button just as a way to say thank you, as well as consider subscribing with all notifications on to further improve your place station experience. Also, if you want to know 5 useful PS5 secret features, then click the video on screen now. Anyway, that's all for me in this video and I'll see you in the next one.